Hi, welcome to today's video. It is February the 15th and of course it's time for our second album of the month for our Make Along Rock 2022 AU. Before we do the second album, I'll review the 1st of February. The album was Dr. Hook and it was well received. There were some amazing inspired colours and projects um, for this album cover. Most of them were posted on our Facebook group page. I think there's about 18 to 20 pictures posted at the moment for February. So for me, I um, added to my zigzag blanket and I used the two different blues on that section there. And I've decided I might do some smaller sections because it could get too big, this lap can. But that's what I did on that for Dr. Hook. And yes, I did a stained glass square um, I got Reeves to graph me out a pattern and I had a go at C to C graph and I did a heart. Look, it's not great. There's a couple of mistakes in it. Whether I use it in my stained glass blanket is another thing. No doubt I'll have more squares than I need. But yes, I had a go at C to C graph because I do have a blanket I want to do and I'm going to need a lot more practice before I attempt that. But they were my two projects for the Doctor Who album. There was some great stories shared about the music and some people actually hadn't heard of them before. So, February the 15th, what album cover? Well, this time it was Thing's Choice and he decided on an album that was released in 1974 on February the 15th. Are you ready for it? Ta-da! Deep Purple's Burn. Yes, this Burn album was originally released on February the 15th, 1974. Have a good look at the cover. I'll show you again soon. I'll give you a bit of research about Deep Purple. Now, in case you haven't heard of them, they are an English hard heavy metal rock band. Their music is rock, hard rock, heavy metal, do do some soul, um, some progressive rock. But yeah, that sort of music. That's the music things into. I'm not really. I don't mind them, but I'm not really into them. Now, you may have heard of their song, their most famous song, Smoke on the Water. Yes, Smoke on the Water is by Deep Purple. There'll be links to some of their music in the description below for you to check them out. Smoke on the Water was released in 1972 and it went to number four on the USA Billboard charts. And then it's now inducted into the Grammy Hall of Fame as a popular song. So we'll get into Burn. Burn was the first album to feature unknown vocalist David Coverdale and Glenn Hughes from Trapeze. Glenn Hughes did bass and vocals and, and David Coverdale did vocals. Burn exemplifies how a band can change members and still deliver amazing music. It reached number one on the Australian chart, album charts, Germany, Denmark, Norway, but it only reached number nine on the USA Billboard chart. So Burn, the major song on the album is, and I did a bit of research because the lyrics, the lyrics of the song are quite, I don't know, a bit out there, but it's believed the song is considered to be about a woman that has been mistreated. Well, she was a good as an angel and due to despair through evil and the devil she turned evil and used dragons to show her hatred and used fire to burn through cities. I will put a link to the lyrics in the description below. So things to inspire your project from the album. Well there are top hats, you could do something there. There are flames, there is some blue hot pinks, oranges, some wax works that can inspire you. The, the actual song lyrics of Burn could inspire you. So let's see what you guys come up with. Me, I'm still racking my brain. I was a bit surprised he picked this, but I do understand considering it was released on February the 15th. Um, 
Now, a few questions that have come in. So in summary, yes, you can use projects you have made for other cows as long as you've made them this year, like 2022, not something you made years ago. You can take a photo, a photo of your project and use it for this cow. If you are using it for another cow, say for Zeta's calendar cow. Now, I do believe there is a pattern for a shawl called Smoke on the Water by Zine and Rogers. I do know someone has made this. It's available on Ravelry. I'll put a link in the description below for you to check it out. I think it's about, it's a paid for pattern. It's about eight or nine dollars, but it is a beautiful shawl if you want to make a shawl. Um, that was one of the questions asked. So if you're new to the channel and you think I'd really like to join this, it's not that hard. There are two raw or music albums shown each month and you have to post at least eight pictures for the year if you want to go in the major prize or the mystery prize at the end of the year and there is a small prize each month for Thorum that's chosen randomly from the pictures posted. Now you can put them in, join our Facebook group and um, I'll put a link to the description below for that. It's Judy Crochet Knitting and More or Knitting Crochet and More, I can't remember. Or you can post them on Instagram, but always remember to use the hashtag rock2022au. Don't forget the au because that's how I find you. Now, guys, it's been a lot of fun. I am enjoying this and I am busting a gut to get started and come up with something for the album Burn by Deep Purple. Now, to inspire future months, how about you leave a comment below on your favourite genre of music or your favourite album, your favourite song, just your favourite musician. And that will help me give some guides to reads and things for future months on what they should pick for my vinyl record collection. There you have it. February the 15th, 1974, Burn by Deep Purple. I hope you enjoy it. And I hope you listen to the music. It might not be everybody's cup of tea, but you never know. Until next time, stay safe, stay well, and be inspired to be creative with rock music. Bye for now.